This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello and welcome to your CBSLA.com News Brief. I'm Rick Garcia. CBS News confirms federal prosecutors are expected to announce charges against Enrique Marquez today. He was a childhood friend and neighbor of Syed Farouk and bought the two assault rifles used in the shooting. Sources tell CBS News Marquez was cooperating with investigators, but that, quote, they did not know whether he was telling the truth about a planned attack in 2012. Nearly 1,900 Porter Ranch students could be relocated because of the ongoing gas leak. LAUSD officials want to temporarily relocate Castle Bay Lane Charter and Porter Ranch Community Schools to other district sites after winter break. The Board of Education is set to consider the proposal today. A trendy restaurant in West Hollywood is accused of serving up reheated dishes. Some of the menu items from Fig and Olive are believed to be shipped to L.A. from a commissary in New York and then warmed up. Fig and Olive told us there was a commissary in the Big Apple that they closed in September. They say all their dishes are now made in-house. We're in the final stretch for the Star Wars fans who have been camping out in Hollywood. The TCL Chinese Theater, with all the hype, the film's general premiere is tonight. For the latest on these stories in your news any time of day, stay with CBSLA.com. A look at your seven-day microclimate forecast. You're going to see temperatures in the 60s turning to the 70s by your Friday. Chance of showers by Saturday and then cooler and partly cloudy for the rest of the week. That's your CBSLA.com news brief. Remember, we're always on. Click Listen Live on our webpage to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations live anywhere you are.